Hi Earth Signs, Taurus, Capricorn and Virgo. Welcome back to my channel everyone. Thank you for being here for your daily reading. We're going to be looking at what's coming up for you today. Any sort of energies or anything that may pop up and can be helpful for you. So if you're dealing with an Earth Sign, a Taurus, Capri, Virgo, this reading can be helpful for you um, just to see what's happening on their end. So um, before I begin, please subscribe to the channel. Um, so if you are at your private reading, you can email me. I am currently accepting those and I can send you through the booking details. Otherwise, let's have a look. Uh, Earth signs. What's the daily message for you for Taurus, Capricorn and Virgo? Okay, funnily enough, as I was meditating on your reading, I actually had the Page of Wands pop up um, pop up in my mind in thought. And I feel like the fact that he's come up here as well, which I had this with another, another element too. Um, the fact that he's come up is, is telling me something about an attraction. So I feel like there is an attraction that may be starting or an attraction that is growing. Um, and I feel like there's some sort of development in this attraction that's happening. Look, it may be with a fire sign. You do have an Aries that has come up here. You also have Pisces. So it may be with one of those signs. Pisces is the last sign of the Zodiac. Aries is the first. So it's either an attraction that's coming to its end, um, maybe in the next 24 hours, or it's an attraction that's beginning. So, Okay, I feel like it's it's one of two ways. Something may happen, someone may do something and you're going to be completely put off by them today, like their behavior, something that they do or they confess to doing. It's going to be a real, um, it's a make or break kind of situation. So I feel like someone's about to make or break this, their, um, their attraction level, like from your side. So your level of attraction. Like I said, it could be something that's coming closer to an ending. Um, or it could be something that's growing and being in its early stages. Um, I feel like you, it may happen online. I feel like you're going to come across something that you didn't see before. So I feel like it could be like a post. You might be doing some stalking and it's going to pay off earth signs. Um, you might see some old emails I feel like with the Eight of Swords, there is a bit of anxiety that's sort of going to push you towards this. Now, this this anxiety is what's fueling this attraction, I think. So they're, they're obviously doing something that's appealing to you, okay? Maybe they're being super mysterious. Maybe they're not, not opening up about your their past. They're withholding something, I feel. Um and it's always been like a delicate subject or an issue with the seven of wands. They've always been either like super defensive about this. And then this is going to sort of make you do some, some research. I actually see you doing some research or some stalking. You're going to come across something. It's around an attraction or someone you're attracted to. Um, so... I'm getting that, yeah, this, this is coming up because you're going to, some information is coming to light here with the sun card. Um, you might be put off, but it's not going to be enough for you to completely walk away. I feel like it could be a bit of a learning curve. So I don't know if there's like something you need to learn by this course of action. Um, but the sun card is telling you to keep an open mind. So I feel like there may be someone here that's telling you to, Keep an open mind with whatever you find or to keep the, the, don't burn the bridge or to keep the door open to this connection for some reason. So there's a reason why, because I feel like there's something more. There's something more that's to come than what you have currently with this person. Um, there could be an unexpected trip. So I could be picking up like a long distance connection or someone who's further away, someone who will show up on your doorstep. You might be surprised. Um, or there may be some sort of brief online um, connection, like you might 
match with someone online on tinder on a dating app and then suddenly that that afternoon that evening you're meeting with them like an online interaction can become physical because i feel like the night of ones someone's gonna someone's coming here towards you um i also get that something you've sort of been fantasizing about is going to materialize um it's an emotional fantasy so i think it's something that's quite near and dear to your heart or something that means a lot to you earth signs um and i feel like it's going to manifest it's going to come to fruition um, with the world card i feel like the universe is sort of orchestrating things for you um and again i keep getting attraction so i don't know if it's a new attraction i don't know if someone's going to confess they're attracted to you uh or like you're going to attract this person I mean, it could just mean you're in a powerful vibration today. Like if you want to attract a cup of coffee, if you want to attract a date, if you want to attract a certain experience, you could be in a very high vibration. You could be very receptive and the universe is sort of in your corner here making things happen for you, earth signs. So pay attention because I feel like attraction is a big theme for you today. Um, attracting, reattracting, detracting, like this is this is the theme for you today so work with it work with what you've got um, because you're in that powerful energy there is a lot of fire cards here so four cards of fire cards um yeah i get some sort of experience where i feel like today's going to be a day where someone's defensive about something and it could be whatever you discover the child in the sun can be like this discovery um, and the world can be like discovery having things come to public view you could be seeing things from a different perspective um because the blindfold's going to be lifted and you've got the sun here so i definitely feel you're putting yourself in someone else's shoes here so a bit of empathy coming through with the page of cups i feel or someone asking you to do that for them um so they obviously want you to understand what they are going through and i feel like this is another energy coming uh, through i feel like this is another person completely different to you um that's coming through in the cards here so it'll be interesting to see how that plays out but i am going to wrap it up there at earth sign so thank you again for watching don't forget to subscribe to the channel and also if anyone was after a private reading with me i am currently accepting those please be in touch um, and we can go ahead and arrange that otherwise have a fantastic day ahead lots of love and angel blessings and bye for now